I'm tired all the time. All right, raise your hand if you feel that way. Feel tired all the time. So many of us do. Well, I'm going to show you medically what happens when you're not getting enough sleep, because sleep is absolutely critical to your health. So let's have a look here at what happens when you lay down your head on the pillow at night. Well, if you're not getting enough sleep, I'll tell you what's happening. You're having memory problems. You can actually not only have irritability, but full-blown depression. You can weaken your immune system. This may not be a known thing, but your perception of pain increases when you're not sleeping very well. Your sleep-deprived brain is actually more active than a healthy brain, but it's not more active in a good way, and I'm gonna show you why. So let's look inside the brain here of someone who is sleep-deprived. What's happening is there are actually changes going on in the sleep-deprived brain that make you feel more hungry. There, you're gonna see what's going on inside the brain here. Leptin is something that usually makes you feel full. Ghrelin in green here makes you feel hungry. When you're sleep deprived, your levels of ghrelin increase. So you want to eat more food. And what kind of food do you want? What do you crave? Carbs, sugar. You want more and more sugar. The more sugar you have in your bloodstream, the more insulin that's released from your pancreas, it can increase your risk for diabetes, but also increase your risk for obesity. So what do you do? You're tired, your memory's gone, you're not feeling very well, you're eating more, you're packing on the pounds, but you're so tired the next morning, you gotta have a cup of coffee, right? But one just won't do, so you gotta have two. 10 a.m. hits, I am exhausted, but I have to get this project done. Let's drink some energy drinks, loaded with caffeine, sugar, so many things you don't need. So what's, what's going on internally is all that caffeine, those stimulants, are causing your heart rate to increase, may even cause your blood pressure to go up. And what's happening up here is not mental alertness. Let's not confuse our caffeine-crazed mind with alertness. It's a jitteriness. It's an uncomfortableness. And what it does is precisely what you're about to see. You lay in bed at night, and you really want to go to sleep, but instead you leave the TV on. You're just desperately trying to fall asleep. And of course, get out of bed, Maybe the only way I can actually fall asleep is if I have a glass of wine. But there's a problem there. This cycle, wine actually disrupts your sleep patterns. It actually prevents you from getting into those deeper stages of sleep. So by this point, you have entered this vicious cycle. It's caffeine, energy drinks, all day long to stay awake, maybe a glass of wine to try to go to bed at night. But in the end, chronic sleep deprivation can lead to obesity, heart disease, high blood pressure, diabetes, depression, GI problems, and so much more.